We're going to begin with that breaking news in Whitestone, Queens. That seaplane came crashing down at Powell's Cove Boulevard and 158th Street around 3 o'clock this afternoon. The single engine Cessna slammed into a pier. The FDNY had to extract all the passengers aboard that plane. One is critically injured. Two others are said to be in stable condition. Eyewitness News reporter Lucy Yang joins us live from the scene. Lucy? Well, Sandra, one resident was so gracious to allow us to report from his beautiful backyard right next door. As you can see, is the Beechhurst Beach Club, which is the scene of the accident. Shortly after three this afternoon, we're told this seaplane crashed into the concrete pier, which belongs to the private beach club. We're in the Beechhurst community of Whitestone, Queens. It is a gorgeous slice of paradise today. It was also a very active scene with firefighters, and police on site. The FAA reports this was a single engine Cessna. And now numbers have been changing through the day, but in the latest account, the fire department says they extricated three civilians with serious injuries from the plane. They also mentioned a fourth civilian, but no word yet on that person's condition. Neighbors tell us they recognize the seaplane as belonging to another resident here, just a few doors down from where we are. Uh, he apparently lives just a few doors down from where we are. It was a wonderful day for a flight until this happened. We were all just sitting in the house and then we heard a loud boom and we thought it was like a truck crash or something. And then my cousins, they came outside and we saw the plane and all of a sudden, two seconds, a bunch of fire trucks just came out and we saw some bodies get pulled out and we hope everyone's okay. So that was Laura Belviso, who lives right next door to this accident site. Um, again, we're hearing four may have been in the plane. At least three were rescued today after a small seaplane crashed into this concrete pier, which is part of the local beach club. You can see where the plane broke up. You can see how close it is to a children's play set. Residents recognize the plane as belonging to one of their neighbors. Officials right now are trying to remove, remove fuel from the plane so they can start to analyze the wreckage. We will have more for you on this developing story. For now, we're live in Queens. I'm Lucy Yang for Channel 7 Eyewitness News.